that leave? Um, where does that leave Port Guinevere? This um, after the verdict fractures the whole round table, and it starts um, pitting brother against brother, cousin against cousin, and a civil war starts between Arthur on the one hand and his loyal knights. And the rabble rouser, Mordred, who is nominally Arthur's nephew, but secretly Arthur's ancestral son. Mordred takes all of the people who feel that change is due, and they meet each other on the Battle of Camelot. And their father and son each strike a mortal blow against the other. Mordred falls and is carried away quickly before people could get a hold of his corpse. And yet, Arthur, <clears throat> mind stripping, was born by his nobleman to the edge of the lake, where it was said a mist rose, a hand reached up from the waters to grasp the throne Excalibur, take it back into the waters, and three queens came, large, veiled, hooded, and they came to gather up the fallen king, place them in the boat, and take him away to Avalon, where he would lie deathless, timeless, until Britain needed him again. One of you was left out of most of this. You can only imagine what she was thinking, how she felt, as all of this rumbled on without any way for her to stop it. But afterwards, <clears throat> she was in theory, free to meet with her lover, Lancelot, who had also survived the war, and yet instead, she chose, for her own reasons, to go into a, a convent, and there to live the rest of her life in a quiet place of prayer, and a place where she would never be put in the position again to have to choose love. And uh, I always think when Lancelot finally comes to visit her, at this convent of his own. What that conversation must have been, for really the two of them understood each other so, so well, and to know that so many things now were between them. Walk with me, my heart. The gate is much too spare a place to see. The garden's put to shame, the meadows blue. Eden set apart. I fancy Eve herself will set a sweet. I see that patch of lilies from my room. I'm glad you finally came. I watched you ride along the path below. I'm turning from that road, but even yet I have so many miles to go. Reconciled my mind to living out my life within these walls. It's not what you had want to hear, I know. What I hope to find is better sought within a cloister's halls, and peace is all that matters to me now. I know you offer them, but in me now that. So I'm turning from that road. I have so many miles to go. I hear he died alone, surrounded by the bodies of his knights. Heaven wept until the tears were Swore I would atone for failing him and shadowing. All the things I did and should have done. So fare thee well, my love. I'll watch you ride along the path below, turning from that road. Even yet, I have so many miles to go. Even yet. I'm so blind.